So we're just over 90 seconds away here from the running of race number four on the program. This is the KRA handicap. So Tournaquet scratching of only an hour or so ago has really thrown this race open, especially in terms of the betting. Cold as cold, number two, was solid enough in a trial at Albany. Toward the rear, loomed up out wide on the track and was solid enough in the run to the post. Number three, Busy One, stayed on without threatening last start when fifth, but... Closing sectionals were pretty good there. Can settle closer today. Kentucky Love is first up. Last seen at Ascot when leading, but eventually running ninth. Blooms. Set outside the leader. Stuck on well for third last start. Is the $2.60 favourite. Dirty Dot is second in at 480. Three wide on speed last start. Actually did get tightened up a bit there late, but was only battling at the stage. Temple Man is $16 here. That's wrong. He should be much shorter than that. Battled away just soundly last start, but that track was a little bit rain affected. And I know Tournake is now gone, but there was only two lengths separating them two starts ago when they met. And... Uh, there was a five kilo swing in the favour of Temple Man. And the beach down the bottom, last seen in the Provincial Championships final, led up a solid fifth in the end. Thanks, Matt. Light comes on. They're set. Favourite is Blooms. Racing. Blooms began okay. Cold as cold has dropped out last early and now going forward the beach is going to roll to the front so the beach goes clear of blooms and kentucky love on the outside back to fourth is busy one in a good position early although fighting for its head slightly there as they come past the 800 Back in the field is Dirty Dot. On the inside is Temple Man at Cold as Cold is last. So the beach leads by three quarters on Kentucky Love. Blooms is in between horses. Two lengths away, Dirty Dot on the outside of Busy One. Then Cold as Cold outside of Temple Man. Past the 600. The beach still leads, albeit only narrowly now. Kentucky Love the outside. Blooms is now forcing between the two. Busy One drives up behind them. Then Dirty Dot, Cold as Cold, Temple Man. In the straight, Blooms goes goes up on the outside of the beach. Then busy one, Kentucky Love, Dirty Dot. Blooms is getting to the beach. Kentucky Love finishing it off with Dirty Dot. Blooms goes to the lead. Late Kentucky Love is thrusting. Kentucky Love dives, gets up. Kentucky Love has spoiled Blooms. And third might go the way of Cold as Cold, but it's close with the beach. Then came Dirty Dot. Back second last, busy one. At last was Temple Man. Kentucky Love. Driven out by Christo Sardelic, has come over the top and has bloused the beach and blooms. The latter ahead of the former, and cold as cold, maybe ahead of the beach. Four in the frame, defeating five, then two cold as cold, getting up to run third in advance of the beach, who led, gave a sight, but has wound up fourth. So four, five, two and eight will be the numbers. Kentucky Love, first up today, has struck. Last seen at Ascot over the 1,400 metres. She's finished with a flurry and gets up to win for Patrick Birmingham and Christo Sardelic, a four-year-old Bay or Brown Mare, Uncle Mo, high on love, Jay Birmingham. Jay Eaton, R&M Mundy, P. Birmingham and Jay Matthews. Defeating five Blooms, who reached the front but was just claimed in the shadows. Four-year-old Bay Mare Warchant, Hepton Stall, Agalipo, Trevor Tasker, Simone Altieri. Then number two, Cold as Cold, six-year-old Bay Gelding, Frost Giant, Diamonds and Bling, Helen Harding, Train Zones, Natasha Faithful. First run for Helen today, formerly prepared by Steve Wolfe and has finished off admirably. Real encouraging display there late in the piece, was doing 
his best work at the very finale. And then number eight, the beach, who set the fractions, certainly will derive further improvement from today's effort. A five-year-old Bay or Brown Mare City place, Frizzled, B. Matthews, David Smith, Chris Nickel. So it's four, five, two, and eight. A neck by a long neck, one, zero, four, eight, six the time. Winner returns six eighty two twenty. Kentucky Love, one dollar fifty about blooms, two dollars forty cold as cold. Quinella twelve ten exact to twenty four fifty. Trifecta one hundred and sixty nine ten. First four seven hundred and forty four fifty. And Christo Sardelic in those white and yellow colours prepares to weigh in after the running of race for the KRA handicap. Race number five, the Monadelphus. Social club handicap, 1,300 the distance. Neat action, 270, looking to rebound after that luckless performance last start. Prior to that, successful here. Punters favouring him to prevail again. Rosie Capilla, last start winner here. Steps up in grade, but is well thought of, 460. 650 fair one, disappointed last start, but had excuses there after getting keen. $7 competitor, too fat, too slow. They just raced okay their last start. And Triggerfish, Christo will be looking to go back-to-back. Is -back. a $9 chance. Had no luck here first up last start. Is the last of them under double figures. Then out to Ultimate Desire, Bella Skelter. And again, exactly half an hour away from race five.